Hello, I'm Sue. And this is my dog, Jimmy. Today, we're going to do some painting. Because Jimmy and I went for a walk this week and found some lovely pebbles hidden in the grass that someone had left. It really made us smile, so we thought we'd find some pebbles and paint them and hide them for people to find. So let's go and find some pebbles. pebbles in our garden. Round smooth ones like this would be really easy to paint. That's quite a large one. Maybe you want to do a slightly smaller one. What do you think Jimmy? Are these good? That's a nice striking one. Don't worry if you haven't got a garden or if you can't get outside. Maybe you've got a friend who could find some pebbles for you and leave them on your doorstep. I'm going to take these three inside and wash them now. See you in a minute. Collected our pebbles. We're going to wash them so they're nice and clean. So here they are. We've got some soapy water. Give them a good rub. Get off all the dirt. Otherwise the paint won't stick to them. <laughs> Jimmy helping. Then we're going to give them a rinse. Sure they're nice and dry. That's it. And when they're clean and dry like this, what do you think, Jimmy? Yeah. Jimmy says that's okay. They're ready to paint. All this painting and walking is really tiring. I've finished painting now. See what you think. So these two are emojis. And this one, I haven't painted all of the stone, so you can still see some of the pebble underneath it. This one here, I've painted like a rainbow on both sides because it stands up. Um, one of the pebbles we found was a rainbow, so I might see if I can hide it next to that. This one here I love. It says, my star. And this one says, be kind. Then there are two ladybirds. They'll look good in the woods. And this one was some something a friend gave to me and it says friends on it so you could write words like that and give the stones to your friends and this one here is a funny little creature so you could maybe paint a pebble and keep it as a pet 
tomorrow I'm going to take all of these pebbles into the woods and hide them so that they can be found. So we're off on our walk. I've got the pebbles we painted earlier and Jimmy's going to lead the way. Here you are, Jimmy. Here is where I found the ladybird. So I think I'm going to hide this ladybird in the grass here. Is that a good place? Is that a good place for it? <laughs> Maybe the person that left the ladybird behind will find that one. Should we go and find some more places? Oh, this one, Jimmy. Should we hide this one? What do you think about this lovely piece of wood here? Should we put it here? Should we hide it here? Is that nice? Is that good? Yeah, I think that's good. Leave that one there. Yeah? Okay, come on then. Let's hide the next one. This tree here is where we found the rainbow stone, so I'm going to leave another rainbow because it's gone now. So we'll put this one here. That one there good? Yeah? I think so. Yeah. Good, that's three done now. Let's go do some more. the pond now so I think maybe we hide another ladybird in this tree trunk here. What do you think Jimmy? Find this one, Jimmy. What's this one? What's this one? Is that good? Yeah, that's good. Lovely. That's another one. Tree here, Jimmy. Should we put this one up here? That's it, my star. Put that one there. What do you think? I think that's a good place. Yeah, very good. We've just got two left now. Let's go and find some more places. Bang my head on the tree. So this is my favourite bit of the woods. I love these mossy trees. Is that a good place? That looks really nice, the yellow and the green. We've got one more. We've got our little creature. And I think I know where to put him. Let's find this tree. Looks 
a face, two eyes, and a nose, and a mouth there. And it looks like there might be a creature that already lives here. So I'm going to put him, where do we think? Just there. It's nice and soft in the moss. We'll leave that one there. That's it. That's all the pebbles hidden. Very good job, Jimmy. So we're back home now. And what Charlie doesn't know is that I kept one of these stones to hide in his favourite mug. And you can hide stones at home as well. Shh, don't tell anyone. And this is his favourite mug. I should put this one in here. <laughs> so when he comes to make his cup of tea, there'll be a little smiley face in there for him.